Hello everybody, this is Cheap Gaming. Welcome back to my channel. Welcome back to Life is Strange. I am filming this video right after filming all of the new war videos. So, downstairs with the morphine. Okay, alternative. Oh, it's alternative Chloe's house. Not real Chloe's house. Okay. Glad we have that clear. So it's not permanent. Thank God. I was really sad because I was... Uh, uh, give me the blue pill. I'm sorry. I'm nosy, but not precise. Go ahead and plug it right in. It's so easy. Okay, Miles. Um, okay, but get ready to yell for your folks if I screw up. Oh, trust me. I will. Of course, my pain just keeps getting worse. But you caught me on a good day. Max, I'm so grateful that I'm even able to hang out with you. Okay. See, I'm getting mushy. I'm already high. <laughs> You're so adorable. Do you want anything else? Um, stop me if I'm being too emo. But can you grab one of the photo albums over there? I'd like to check out some old pictures of us when we were Ah, uh, yes. Okay, this is where I left Please. off. My diary is like emo ground zero. Plus, Max Caulfield does not pass up a photo off with Chloe Price. Ever. Um. Where? Snow globes are taking over. <laughs> Oh, the snow dough. I guess not yep, everything Yep, it's changed. the same snow dough. She said something about the photo album. Oh my god. I made that mix for her when we were 12. Um. Hey, so. That's a serious heat lamp. That's a heat lamp? Oh, it is. From this perspective, it looked like a microphone. Did Chloe look at the garden and think about her childhood? She can't even feel the grass now. Ah, here it is. I'm sorry, but no, I am... Sir. Chloe was a straight A student. She could have gone to any college. Gutless bastard. I'm so glad Chloe stole your bullshit fun. Even if it wasn't another reality. Yeah, fuck him. Okay. What, what, what the fuck is my camera? Okay. She I'm like digging to use a lot of lotion to keep her blood circulating. I'm sorry, bestie. Nothing I'm but medical supplies. I'm going through all of your shit. Bracelet. There's the old Chloe. That must be her mighty morphine machine. No more bongs for her. Yep. Yeah. Is that okay? Perfect. Oh my god, look how little we are there. We look like toys. I remember that day by the lighthouse. My dad was pissed at us. He actually tried to give us a time out. You laughed at him. <laughs> my dad would have banished me. Turn page, let's go. Oh, awesome picture. You look so badass in our pirate gear. We should have taken over Arcadia Bay when we had the chance. There's still time for you. Turn page. Oh man, there we are making pancakes. I love that shot of us. It's hard to believe my dad took that picture only five years ago. 
Literally seems like yesterday. I wish it was. Let's see. This photo. Maybe I could. Listen, Max. My respiratory system is failing, and it's uh, only getting worse. And it's only getting worse. I've heard the doctors talking about it when they thought I was zonked out. So, I know I'm just putting off the inevitable while my parents suffer along. And I will too. This isn't how I want things to end. What? What are you saying? I'm saying that being with you again has been so special. I just wanted to feel like when we were kids running around Arcadia Bay and everything was possible. And you made me feel that way today. I want this time with you to be my last memory. Do you understand? Yes, I do. All you have to do is crank up the IV to 11. I don't... Chloe. Chloe. Oh. My best friend is asking me to slaughter her. She... I mean, there is an I don't know uh, option, but I, I feel like if I say that, I'm going to piss her off. If I, I know if I say no, I'm going to piss her off. And I know if I say yes, it's just going to be me, me literally killing my best friend. <sighs> Why does the game keep throwing difficult decisions in my face? I don't... I really didn't want to have to... In real life, I would say no, because I'd be like, nah, fuck that. You're not finna be a pussy, but it's a game, so I'll do it. Chloe, I'll just drift asleep, dreaming of us here together, forever. So much more sad when I have to watch it. Thank you so much. I'm so proud of you for following your dreams. Don't forget about me. Never. I love you, Max. See you around. Sooner than you think. Now I just feel like a complete dick. I will focus Sorry. on the photo.
Okay, I gotta focus it again. Here we are. Time to go back in time again. Someday Dad will get one of them newfangled computers. I hope the flash didn't scare you, Max. This is a keeper. Hello? Hey, honey. What? Oh, I didn't know you had to get groceries. Of course I'll come pick you up. Where are my keys? Aha! Uh -huh. You can't hide from me forever. And no Chloe and Max wine tasting. Dad, don't blow it because tonight your mother promised to make us a world famous salmon surprise with chocolate cake for dessert. Max, you'll be here too, right? He's never leaving. That makes all of us. Max, you are being so fucking strange. Like you're never gonna see us again. Chloe, I'm so sorry. I tried to make things different for you. I, I did try. I'm sorry. I don't know exactly what you're talking about, but come on. You have made things different, like my whole life. You're my best friend. I've got you and a great family. What's to be sorry for? We'll be best friends forever. And when we grow up, we're taking over the world. Listen, whatever happens, I want you to be strong. Even if you feel like I wasn't there for you. Because I will never abandon you, Chloe. I'll always have your back. Always. Aww. Don't make a real nigga cry like that. Oh, I didn't cry, but... see okay everything is back to normal I hope Max, you get one kiss, now you're all over me? I'm just, I'm just, I'm so glad you're here. You sound high, but thanks for the morning grope. Since we were up all night <laughs> playing CSI Arcadia Bay, I was still spaced out here trying to put all this info together. Max, did you forget we've gone over this? I hope you weren't messing around with time while I was sleeping. Not anymore. I'm just spaced out too. Welcome back to the real world, Max. I don't think I can ever tell Chloe about what happened. No, let's not. She'll hate us even more if we tell her we killed her.
Let's look at the big board and see all our pieces okay, let's get up. so far. Poor Kate. So close yet so far away. We have to do three main things. Right. Um, what things? One, decipher Frank's log. Two, get Nathan's phone to find out where he's been during the Vortex Club parties with Kate and Rachel. And see whatever hidden shit he's got in his messages. Three, beat Step Douche Dan until he tells us about Frank, Nathan, and the Dark Room. And I do have a gun with. Keep it in your pants. We'll have to do this on our own. Dude, at least let me kick his ass, then rewind. Fine, whatevs. It's your power. Which I can't waste on shit like that. Or Blackwell would be in big trouble. At least you let me take that money to pay Frank off. Don't remind me. I just want him off your back. Our back. I know. You should get busy in the garage to see what dirt you can dig up. I'm gonna cyberstalk some names and see where that leads. Or to who. And be careful of Stepcrack. He's not gonna be a happy camper after you reamed him yesterday and Mom is giving him the boot. I'm on it, partner. I can't abuse... I can't abuse this level of something. Oh no. That poor little bird has been trapped in here. Too late. I don't care about the bird. I got shit to do. Fuck the bird. Oh, the lag. You won this what? battle, Max. You broke up my family. I salute you. David, I didn't try to hurt you. Ever. But I won't let anybody hurt Chloe. Too late, isn't it? You just better be damn careful with her. Don't you wander off into the dark. Damn. I'm sorry, dog, but... You're a fucking creep. His laptop isn't here, it looks like. It looks like David finished his car repairs. Maybe there's some new clues around. <laughs> Two messages from Warm. Yo, yo, Max. Your friend Chloe texted me that I'm out of the loop now. She sounds... She sounds hot, so I get why. What? Chloe actually texted you? I sure didn't have her number. Uh, now I get why you didn't want to go ape with me. You should go with Chloe. She looks cool enough for you. I have a lot... I have a, a lot of cool friends like you. Yes, you do. Just my luck. And mine. I have to jet. Talk to you later. I hope so. I'm sorry. Whoa. Oh. Okay. Max, this is Richard Marsh, Richard Marsh again. I wanted to let you know that Kate's service is next week. And our family would like to extend an invitation to you. I know you've been through a lot and we fully understand if you can't attend. Kate was our special angel and your friendship with her blessed us all. I'll send you the details later today. Again, thank you for being a light in the darkness. Thank you, Mr. Marsh. I absolutely will attend the service. I know my words don't mean much, but I want you to know that Kate is always in my thoughts and will and always will be. Okay, whatever. I don't care about that. Hey, Wax. I'm busy blazing. Oh. Sad up had to... Sorry, my phone was in my bag. Hey, Justin, you busy? Max Wax. I'm busy blazing. What up? Powers and drugs. <laughs> That's it. Ask Nathan. He knows him, I think. Okay, I'm on it. Thanks, Justin. For what? Juliet. 
Why? Wait. Hey Max, I hope you're okay after everything. You might be busy, but feel free to call me anytime. Hey Juliet, are you busy? No time to be busy. You never text me. What's going down? Besides everything, I was just curious if you ever heard of a guy named Frank who lives in an RV around town. You mean a van down by the river? I heard he's a sketchy meth head. That's about it. Why, are you doing your own investigation without my help? No, just bored. Talk soon. Thanks. Okay, but you can't keep secrets from ace reporter Juliet Watson. Hello? Chloe, of course. And that was no emoji. Okay. Email. In paper form? I promise I'll help Miss Grant next time. If there is one. Oh, meow, Miss Grant. Twist that knife. At least he has one weird fan. Wish I had surveillance footage of that conversation. Map. Surveillance cameras at Pan Estates? David must be working for the Prescotts, too. What a bitch. There's more to David Madsen than meets the eye. He should finish this letter to Joyce. Joyce, you know I'm not good at explaining myself or why I act the way I do sometimes. I only know that nobody has ever understood me the way you do. I would never do anything to hurt you or Chloe. Taking care of my family is my number one mission. Yes, I overstepped bounds with the surveillance and suspicion, and I am truly sorry and ashamed. But there are dark things happening in Arcadia Bay I have never told you. You are my wife and partner, and I know we should have no secrets. I intended to tell you everything, but I wanted more proof. Instead, a student committed suicide on my watch. You kicked me out of my favorite home, and my stepdaughter hates me. Please let me... Dot, dot, dot. Either Chloe stole another gun, or David is out there armed. What the hell did David do for Nathan? And what did his dad do for David? Thanks for your help with Nathan. It is appreciated. I wonder if David is going to the party. Huh. That'd be fucking funny. Bust his ass too. How about that shit? Oh, William that makes me stuff. sad. It was so incredible to see William again. I wish Chloe could too. Yeah, I'd say. Alright, time to come into here. Take a look around. Whoa, that is a serious padlock on that locker. Hey, David, what you hiding? I know your password, dog. It was 7676. Shit. What? Oh, no, it was 7671. 7176. 7171. There we go, that's what it was. Yes, I knew that number would be important. <sighs> oh, maps, notes, coordinates, photos of Kate, Nathan. Oh, yes. Okay. Ooh, bunch of coordinates. Photos, photos, photo of me? Score. Back to Chloe now. Maybe not. Oh, look at the baby blue jay eggs in the nest. I, I, but, excuse me. Just 
One picture, please. Yeah, I will gladly take the photo. Click. Another photo from my Arcadia Bay Wildlife series. Okay, cool. Wait, can I move that back? I can move it oh, back. Thank you. Sleep tight, my eggy legs. And there doesn't seem to be anything else I can do, so I'm just going to go back up to Chloe. Nope. It's, looks like David already booked a room. Yep. Okay. Yo, Chloe! Are you ready yet? I have to get back to my dorm. Are we happy? Very happy. I hit the secret file jackpot. Kate, Nathan, and Rachel. Plus some location coordinates. David is like a one-man surveillance army. Now let's get the hell out of here before we get busted. Now let's go find out what Nathan is hiding in his room. We have to be extra careful. Max, now it's time for Nathan Prescott to be afraid of us. Facts. Let's go. That's the campus, Chubby. Tiki pole. Interesting. Hey, Max. How you doing? Oh, hi, Mr. Jefferson. I'm okay. Um, and this is my friend, Chloe. Yeah. Chloe? Why isn't somebody as cool as you going to Blackwell? I was way too cool for this school. It's a long story. In actual files here. I can imagine. Max, are you sure that you're all right? It's weird just being on campus like everything's normal. I know. Lame as it sounds, life has to go on. I think there's too much going on in my life. On that note, Blackwell duty calls. Remember, I'm going to announce the winner of the Everyday Heroes contest tonight at the party. So I hope you'll be there to celebrate. Even though I'm sorry you didn't enter a photo. I understand your reasons. You can't force an artist to work. I feel like a total loser, but it's been a hard week to focus. No pun intended. I'm proud of you for caring so much about a troubled friend. And I take hope in the fact that you have plenty of time to find your way. Just get in the habit of putting your work out there. Thanks, Mr. Jefferson. I'll definitely be there tonight. Me too. I'll be Max's date. You better dance with us at least once. And nobody should have to see me dance. Plus, you don't want to watch the old hipster trying to keep up with the kids. I have some <laughs> pride. Be seeing you. Yes, you will. Hot floor teacher. Rose! You are out of control. Not yet. Just wait until the rager tonight. <sighs> Shut up. Don't be jealous because Mark Jefferson thinks I'm cool. I am so ignoring you. Fine. Since I'm here, I'll see if I can get some dirt from Justin. I haven't talked to him in a while. Now that is a great plan. All right. Let's see if I can find out where Nathan is. On my way, bitch. Justin, it's been so long since I've seen you. Hey, you way too cool for, for us now, yet? Chloe. Way too much shit going on, man. Try going to Blackwell. Insane. So I hear. Can you worry at all, Rachel? Dude, I wish. I'm so. I had to clear away another batch of dead birds today. Sad. How are you doing, Max? Been a tough week. I know. Yes, it has, Samuel. Are, How are you? I'm still convinced that Sad there's something confused, wrong with you. Sad like everybody else in Arcadia Bay. You look like you have a lot of questions, too. People. More questions than answers. Samuel is always here to talk. 
Nathan. Have you seen Nathan Prescott around? That would be hard since he was suspended. He deserved, he deserved it. it. And more. Samuel tries not to judge people, but Nathan shouldn't be here. Maybe he's supposed to be here, though. What do you really know about him? Not enough to help hey, you, Hey, do you see that in the background? I truly wish I could. I see what you're doing. I'm sorry. I better get going now. Now? I don't care about anything but Who can I ask? Hi, Miss Grant. Max, you always show up when I'm talking about you. And I swear, it's not about that petition you didn't sign. Nathan. I was looking for Nathan Prescott and I thought he might be in your class. Mr. Prescott has no class at all after his suspension. I didn't think you were friends. Hell no. Hell no. Sorry, Miss Grant. You're an adult. You can swear, damn it. <laughs> and I'm glad you did. So you haven't seen Nathan at all? Let's just say I try not to, Max. But I did catch him storming off campus. After what happened this week, I hope you don't see him either. You're not the best student here, but you, you might be the wisest. Thanks for that. I'm sorry, Miss Grant. I, I have to get going. I I'll see you later. It's always good talking to you, Max. Good. Nathan is not around. I should go back to Chloe. Well, Chloe's literally right here, so. Coast is clear. It would be so cool if you and me were going to school here together. But now you can have Mr. Jefferson all to yourself. Ah, oh, you suck. <laughs> now let's get into Blackwell Ninja Moon. Oh, why does it gotta show the roof after all that? <sighs> it's so lame, they don't have colored bones here. Yes, because I want Nathan Prescott in the room next door. Good point. Wait here. Give me the signal if Nathan or anybody shows up. I won't let you down, Batmax. Batmax. Now I just have to find Nathan's room. Air Max. These guys are just sitting shit. <laughs> it's the sitting shit. Poor Warren. This is the work of Nathan. He's so lucky I'm a pacifist. So that's Warren's room. Looks like one of the jocks did care about Kate. Okay. Ugh, skunkweed and video games. I sense Hayden is near. It's cause it probably is. This can only be Nathan's room. All right, let's go. Uh, yep, do it in reverse time. Now, all I need to do... Now I need to find Nathan's phone, or anything with clues. Because, haha, <laughs> now it never happened. Okay. That is so Chloe. And you're going to pay, oh motherfucker. God. Chloe. Oh, Chloe. Oh, 
That must be the lamp Chloe broke when Nathan drugged her. Go fucking figure. I really hope they were all consenting models. That's so cute and ironic. I can't believe Nathan still has it around. Whatever. That monochrome camera is brand new and costs about six grand. Bastard. Yeah, it's I thought is... Victoria had the photo bling, but once again, the Prescott's rule. What? I don't think this prescription uh. has helped me. I don't think one book can guide the Prescotts. The Teen Parent Guide to Anger Management. Well, that never helps. Damn, Nathan. That's a nice shot. If only all your energy went into photography. It's so damn creepy, but the guy has his own style. Yeah, well, nobody cares about that bitch motherfucker anyway. Oh man, that dickhead stole one of my selfies. That looks like a totally fun show. Even Nathan has a light side. Nathan took this from Kate's altar. Why? What the fuck? What is with this dude? Nathan likes his tortured subjects way too much. These films all have a dark pattern. He has everything in here except peace of mind. Holy shit. That's the gun Nathan used on Chloe. A gift from... Yeah. I'd cry too if I had him for a father and had to wear that suit. Let's see what Nathan hides in here. Yep, let's go. Nathan is way into this party. Bad sign. Oh, bastard. Now I remember why I hate you. And why Kate will get justice. Oh, man. Sean uh, Prescott might be Nathan's real problem. Too bad Nathan isn't more like his sister. She sounds awesome. And far away. Yes, Nathan sure needs diet pills. This is strong stuff. Wow. Kiss ass much, Principal Wells. Okay. Oh. What the hell are all those marks on the floor? Okay. Let's Move find out bitch. what you're hiding. Oh yes, little phone. You are mine now. Now I have Nathan's phone, so I can show it to Cool. Now it's open. Okay. Let's get the fuck out of here, Chloe. Damn, Max, you're finally back. I got worried. So, what did you find? His room was clean and creepy. Check this out. Boom, Nathan. We got you by the balls, fucker. What are you doing in my dorm? You're such a nosy bitch, Max. Stop right there, Nathan. Make me, ho. <clears throat> Max, I got this. Get the fuck out of my face. <clears throat> you are so fucking dead. Get off me, bro. 
<laughs> Bitch. I'm gonna stay out of this shit. You like to hurt people, huh? Like Max? Like Kate? Like me? Huh? Feel this, motherfucker! You put too much emphasis on the, uh, motherfucker! Get up! Off me! Please! Please stop! He's down! Hey, come on! Stop! This is what you get, bitch! Yes, we have to go! I was about to drip my vape, too. Who's the bitch now? Chloe! God, you... You got beat up by a science geek. Damn, Warren went full alpha on Nathan. And it was good. But scary. Shit, man. This really hurts. Where's that gun? You punk bitch. Can I snap a photo of your bitch ass in fetal position? Punk bitch, let's get out of here. You ought to know my character rolling around with thugs. Damn, that was intense. Warren, thank you so much. For what? For beating the shit out of Nathan Prescott? Dude, you rule. I don't know. I kind of went crazy there. Like Nathan. You're not anything like him. Good to know. So where are you going? I better stick with you guys. Just in case you need me to get my Hulk on again. Or should I call the cops on Nathan? No police. Not yet. Uh, so maybe you better... Um, Warren, me and Max have to do this on our own. No offense. It's cool. Whatever I can do to help. What you can do is find out anything you can about Nathan's father. I'm on it. Between the snow and eclipse, I'm assuming the apocalypse is around the corner. And yeah. thank you. Seriously. I'll call you later. You better. I'm feeling pretty alpha now. Yes, you are. Yeah, Warren, go hit the gym. Man, that guy is so fucking in love with you. I know. He really did give a serious beat down to Nathan. It was a little scary to watch him do that. Now let's make a date with Frank. Will he even answer you? Frank always answers when he wants money. Like I said, Frank wants to see me right now. Let's not keep him waiting. Let's go. Give this nigga five. Uh, head on fuck up on out of here. Oh. God. I hate seeing those poor whales like that. Me too. I just. Think of their families in the ocean out there looking for them. Well, that asshole's gonna help us find Rachel. Or what? You'll actually shoot him? Chloe, do not count on my rewind. Please. Obviously, I'm not counting on you. That's why I have a gun. And I might even save you someday. About time. I am so <laughs> going to hit you. There's no way we could have guessed this is what okay. would happen to us when we grew up. I'm looking forward to the day when we can just go on a road trip to Portland. Fuck yeah. You, me, and Rachel. Absolutely. So let's play this cool, okay? Just pay Frank his money, and then we can get that code for the book from him. That's all. Got it. No dicking around. Let's roll. Chloe, why don't you get that far ahead of me? Get the fuck back here. 
You know he's pissed about us using his shit. Frank doesn't need tinted windows when they're this dirty. Can't see inside with this shit blocking the view. This is where Frank ponders his existence and gets drunk. Okay, well, I'm gonna stop this video here for now. This is Sheep Gaming, and I'll see all you guys in the next video. Peace out.